Okay, today we're headed out to uh, Kiwi Bay subdivision. Kind of give you a feel for this neighborhood, north end of the lake, up near Turtle Head. Uh, waterfront and interior properties is gated. Older neighborhood, 20 plus years of age. You'll see some different homes. Uh, there's a home in here, uh, you know, from the 1800s on the water. Uh, and then uh, we've got newer homes that are built, being built uh, in the 2000s. So uh, let's go ahead. We come in the neighborhood. You can turn right. Let's go ahead and turn right. I want to take you down by the uh, boat ramp and uh, a little club, not a clubhouse, but just a little outdoor area that we have uh, here in Kiwi Bay. You have boat storage, which is going to be coming up on the right. So if you're a property owner in Kiwi Bay, yeah. You can store your boat here in the summertime, wintertime, if you'd like. It's over here to our right. We'll look at that in just a minute. We've got several streets in the neighborhood. Won't be able to cover all the side streets today, but this just to kind of give you an over, overall feel for the community. Got a new home going in here on our left, and we'll look at these by water later on. Just try to cover some of the roads today. Go down here to the boat ramp boat slips so you know like I said Kiwi Bay has its own private boat ramp a lot of communities on the lake uh, majority of them do not Kiwi Bay is one of them that does can't see the boat slips today behind all the mountain lore but we'll look at them by boat uh, and then uh, there's a little club a little outdoor facility uh, ahead there that we could use as property owners in the neighborhood okay got over a hundred 100 home sites here in Kiwi Bay, water and interior, and most of the, a lot of the interior lots do come with deeded boat slips. So this is some of our boat slip storage to the left, and then we have another, another big uh, boat storage uh, facility here, not covered, just an outdoor facility. And I'll kind of show you that here. So we could park several, probably 30, 40, 50 boats in there. All right, let's kind of go back out towards the main road and kind of just go through. Uh, like I said, we can't cover all the streets today, but uh, we're going to try to just give you a good feel for the neighborhood itself. A lot of trees, a lot of hardwoods, nice northern, northern end Lake Kiwi feel. Nice interior home there on the right. We're back to the gate now where we came in. Let's just kind of go straight here. Most of these homes that you're going to see here on the uh, coming in on the left and right will be interior homes. Road will kind of fork here. Let's just take the left hand fork and just kind of head down. Like I said, most of these that were all of these that were looked at, all of these homes. Where we're going here today uh, are interior homes. Head down towards the waterfront properties now. You know, a little hilly in Kiwi Bay, kind of up and down neighborhood, a great neighborhood to exercise, ride a bike, walk, uh, if you like getting some good exercise. This is just Kiwi Bay Circle straight ahead, but we're going to turn left here. And uh, got a nice little, uh, got a nice little pond here in the community about a two about a one and a half two acre pond so that's nice and right now we're on inland drive excuse me inland, inland drive just turned off to the left I'm sorry So we're going to be, you know, we're hitting the, the basically the two main roads are in here today. So we've got, you know, several miles of, of, of roads in here. Nice waterfront home there to the right, overlooking the lake. So with over, you know, a hundred properties 
here in Kiwi Bay, it's a, it's a pretty it's a pretty large community for the north end of the lake, outside of like the cliffs and the reserves, for it to be over 20 years of age. Got a little road that turns off to the left there, but we're going to actually dead end here in just a moment and come to the end of Kiwi Bay. And we'll get back out on the boat and be able to see a lot of these properties. Like I said, we end right here at the water. We'll get back on, out on the boat, be able to see a lot of these properties from the water.